The Labor Party has avoided a potentially damaging debate after the party's Victorian state conference came to an abrupt end. Delegates were set to vote on contentious motions, including a call for federal Labor to shut down offshore detention centres if elected. But debate was shut down, with the party not wanting to expose any internal divisions ahead of the Super Saturday of by-elections. James Oten reports. After a weekend of debate, it was the abrupt end of the state Labor conference that left a lasting impression. I'm extremely disappointed, uh, upset actually. Sorry. The Victorian Labor conference was set to debate a motion that called on a federally elected Labor government to shut down offshore detention centres within 90 days of taking office. It's an issue that could expose deep party divisions. A Labor government will stop the boats. Victoria's most senior Labor figure, Bill Shorten, affirmed the party's existing policy and asserted there'd be no change. You know, I'm very committed to making sure the boats don't start again. Uh, we also just happen to think that we shouldn't have kept people in semi-indefinite detention for five years in order to achieve this. I think you will find that there is a schism at the heart of the ALP. But just before the debate was due to start, that motion and several other contentious matters were deferred. Powerful unions, the AWU and CFMEU, teamed up to bring an abrupt end to the conference. There'll be a time for debate, so it's just democracy at work. <laughs> there were some strange alliances of unions that decided they'd rather go home than talk about those important issues. We've yeah. sat here for two days. I would have loved everything to have continued. A motion about changing the date of Australia Day was also withdrawn. This is an act of cowardice by Daniel Andrews. He has sought to avoid the contentio contentious issues. I've been very clear about the fact that January 26 is our <coughs> national day. Deferring these matters to the admin committee means they'll now be discussed and decided behind closed doors, meaning Labor avoids such controversial topics being debated in public, giving the party some breathing space. And with Federal Labor gearing up for a super Saturday of by-elections, clear air is something it'll want for the campaign. James Oten, ABC News, Melbourne.